everyone this is mayur welcome to ml implementation today i will be implementing knearas neighbor using numpy so again there are multiple steps involved first is importing the packages followed by creating a class uh, model class okay and then we have multiple methods inside this class this is first is int method then followed by fit then followed by predict and there is another method called as hyphen underscore predict okay so here then next step is to train and test the model okay so uh, we'll understand why we need underscore predict because uh, k nearest neighbor is a very simple algorithm compared to all the other primary algorithms we have seen earlier like linear regression and logistic regression and the reason why it is simple is because it doesn't require anything to learn actually so it is purely based on a uh, distance metric so i have missed one point here actually along with underscore predict we also need something called as euclidean distance method yeah so this completes our algorithm so i'll start importing the packages which are required import numpy as num np for data sets i'll use sklearn import sklearn sklearn data sets sds import uh, sklearn dot model selection as so i'll just do this from then i'll do this import train test split okay and also there is one thing uh, which another library which we need to import that is from collections import counter the reason why we are importing counter is because counter has uh, an inbuilt method called as most common which will help us in what finding the most common uh, among the uh, key neighbors okay so we'll understand when we are implementing it actually this one so since we are done with what importing the packages i'll just start writing the class now knn okay and the while initializing we can initialize uh, number of neighbors we want to look at so by default k is equal to 5 so self dot k is equal to k and for fit method i'll be uh, importing only uh, the parameters will be uh, x and y which is our in features and target variable self dot x is equal to x and self dot y is equal to y so here it dones with what this is done with fit method because we are not going to what uh, train anything we are just going to see the distance between our what test sample data point uh, with the trained sample data point so next is uh, our predict method which will take in our test samples so x underscore test okay so it should be compared with our training set so what i'll do is here y underscore pred is equal to here i'll just write underscore self dot predict i'll just take a sample for sample in x underscore test so what it will do is for every sample we take from test set it will be predicting against training set or in a sense it will what compare with the training set and find which is the nearest class to this particular test sample okay so here we have this one then return is equal since this is a list we have to turn it into an array in underscore predict okay so def is equal to underscore okay before going to underscore predict i'll just do euclidean distance how to find the euclidean distance this is equal to since the distance between the two vectors actually so we have to find the distance between two vectors v1 comma v2 so here distance is equal to v1 comma v2 so the formulation is 
एन पी स्क्वायर रूट एस क्यू आर टी फॉलोड बाई एन पी डॉट सम देन वी हैव समथिंग कॉल्ड एस वी वन माइनस वी टू द होल स्क्वायर सो दिस विल गिव अस द डिस्टेंस बिटवीन द टू विक्टर्स सो दिस इज डन विथ वॉट यूक्लीडियन डिस्टेंस देन वी हैव अंडर स्कोर प्रिडिक्ट फंक्शन विच विल टेक इन अ सैम्पल this is the test sample and we already have this string sample here okay so what i'll do here is self underscore then just take the sample and now we have to do find the distance between this test sample with the training set okay so first i'll just take the distances is equal to for test set x in self dot x okay i want to find the distance between euclidean distance between so uh, x comma sample okay so this will give us all the distances between this particular sample and all the uh, data points present in x train okay now we have to find uh, the nearest Oh, five data points okay since we want to look for k nearest neighbor here k is equal to 5 by default so we have to find the k nearest uh, data points for this particular sample so what i'll do is uh, here underscore index np dot arc sort there is something called as argument sorting so what this will do is it will sort our distances and we want like five nearest distances so we have like self dot k so this will give our five by default it will give five distance five nearest data points in the x train okay so once this is done then we have to find uh, so here we will be getting what indexes okay from the training sample indexes of the five records which are nearest to the test sample now we have to find the label of that particular uh, all those five nearest samples right five nearest samples we have to find their labels so y underscore label is equal to self dot y this is index for i in distance underscore indexes so here we will be getting the class class details here and next step is here will be like see like totally since we are using like phi right by default since we are using phi as the nearest neighbor we'll have phi uh, class here okay and if it is a binary classification okay then probably we'll have some combination of like what 1 0 1 0 0 so here we have something like what there are three samples belong to zero class and two samples belonging to one class so we have to find the most common one that's why for finding the most common one we'll be using the counter library here so y is equal to a counter of y label then we have to do most common one so this is like little tricky actually so what i'll do is we'll just print Which class? Okay, I'll just print this one y, and then we'll modify later. Actually, yeah. Okay, so in a sense, yeah. So this is done with the algorithm. We are done with what K N N. Now we have to what import the data set. For that, we have to use a uh, D S library which we imported already. So x comma y is equal to i'm not sure if this will work load is equal to iris data set so i just think this is d data i guess this will be data one second so this this is loaded let's see what it how it is present okay okay so x comma y is equal to data dot data comma data dot target i guess that's the way it has been present here it's a dictionary i guess yeah yeah target yeah so this is done then we have to what train test split the 
data set we have now x underscore train comma x underscore test is equal to oh, followed by y underscore train y underscore test is equal to train split x comma y followed by test size is equal to 0 0.2 random state random state is equal to 1 okay so we have done with what train to split so now what we have to do is we have to initialize the k nearest neighbor k in n is equal to so i'll just write it as small case k in n is equal to so we have to see how many neighbors we want to look at so here k is equal to 5 I give us 5 or 10 okay next I will be what fitting this on top of this x train and y train next we have to do prediction on test set so y underscore pred is equal to so I'm not sure how this will look like actually why so we have to test it out okay so knn dot predict okay so here we have to give underscore test okay let's see how it imports okay throws an error oh method is not subscribed okay okay so this is not subscribable i guess how to do counter right we have to see how we have to use counter mm, collections counter okay this is looks okay this is counter of my list okay then it should work right since this is a list okay okay object is not subscript okay okay i guess this is the uh, here we have to change i guess this is not subscriptable right okay well, let's see what it gives yeah so here we can see uh, the most common is the first we are seeing this one 0 comma 10 1 comma 10 okay there are three classes right we have three classes and okay okay so if i look at the first one let's see what it shows okay the most common okay we are getting all the classes here classes details here and let's what we'll do is next we have to since we got all the classes here we'll do the accuracy check so define accuracy here y underscore true comma y underscore pred is equal to written in p dot sum y underscore true is equal to equal to i underscore pred followed by length of the total data set that is y underscore true okay we have written the accuracy function now we have to test it out and our predictions are underscore y pred let's see if it works or not okay okay so our model gives an accuracy of 96.6 percent of accuracy and we are almost done actually so this is implementation of k-nearest neighbor and if you find this video helpful, please do subscribe. Thank you.